Despite receiving more leaves than her, Leonardo DiCaprio complained about Titanic's arduous filming, saying, I guess I was raised to be grateful. After playing the parts of Jack and Rose in the film Titanic, Leonardo DiCaprio and Kate Winslet established themselves as one of Hollywood's most recognizable on-screen pairings. The movie Titanic later became the first to earn more than $1 billion at the box office. James Cameroon's stunning cinematography, the outstanding acting by the ensemble, and a dedicated crew were all key factors in the film's enormous success. Leonardo DiCaprio supposedly had had enough by the time the movie's filming was finished since the hours of filming were so long. Filming Titanic had become a drag for Leonardo DiCaprio. Filming for Titanic required numerous days to complete a single scene, which added to the film's overall difficulty. The movie had 14-hour marathon shootings, and Leonardo DiCaprio supposedly once decided he'd had enough midway through the movie's production. The Wolf of Wall Street actor reportedly said in Vanity Fair that one day just walked over to the set, took a good look at the four sound stages, the 17 million gallon water tank, the smokestacks rising majestically against the sky, and the hordes of extras running around in period clothing, and thought, this is bullshit. When discussing the demanding Titanic shoot schedule and how miserable DiCaprio was, Kate Winslet once shared her own experiences. Taking a go at the Inception actor for being sad during filming Titanic, Kate Winslet. In a previous interview with The Guardian, Kate Winslet discussed how young she and Leonardo DiCaprio were while they were filming the Titanic movie. She stated, I turned 21 on that shoot, and Leo turned 22. When the journalist recounted how he had met with DiCaprio, the actor stated that he had been miserable while filming the picture, and Winslet heard this, she just started giggling. She went on to say, I recall, I clearly recall him to be. Although none of us enjoyed it, we were all involved, despite the fact that he had many more days off than I ever did. I suppose I was taught to be appreciative and move on. I didn't believe it was appropriate for me to be unhappy, and if I had been, I most definitely would not have told a reporter. There is no way I would have let that slip.